Hi, good morning, and welcome back to another studio vlog. It's actually Friday morning today, and I have a day off, so I'm kind of just taking it chill and playing a lot of Animal Crossing, and I'm not really sure what I'm going to do today. I know I'm going to be editing my video because I haven't been on top of things, but besides that, it's mostly just been a calm day. I feel like I haven't done enough drawing recently. Like, I have things, but I really haven't been drawing a lot, so <laughs> we'll see how that goes. <laughs> well, in other news, I checked my mail and I got something special again! So, I ordered this from my friend's shop and I already opened it, but it's so cute! Little bears! This is called Mitsurashi Dango which is like the Japanese rice balls, but they're shaped like bears and they have this like strawberry coating on them and look at this freaking packaging, it's so pretty this is by my friend Len, she wrote a little note on the back too and I really love it <laughs> and I'm gonna wear them soon thank you so much Len, I love it so much how do I open this? So cute! I actually met her at a convention last year and I was really happy because she told me like um, I was one of her first art trades at a convention. It was really fun and she's so sweet. She gave me this earring here. It's also kind of this like bear bakery theme that I really love. It looks like this and it's got these golden spoons and forks. Super sweet. She makes them by hand with clay. So it's really cool and special. Go check out her stuff if you can. Also right now, I'm looking at some online shopping. My friend Kiana just updated her store, so I'm looking at stuff that I want to buy. Who doesn't love plant things?
also, I got some things in the mail. I've been kind of bad with checking my mail these days just because I think everything's just gonna be super delayed, but actually these came in really fast. I got two trades from friends and then I got a package from Sticker App. So last time I did a lot of orders from Sticky Mule and Sticky Mule is the one that I usually stick to but I wanted to try something different mostly because I wasn't happy with the way that my holo stickers came out so we'll see. Ooh, there's so many and they look just as good as the Sticky Mule ones. Wow, it came with this Fight COVID sticker. Pretty nice. Remember to wash your hands always. <sighs> okay, this next one I'm kind of worried about because I haven't had good luck with hollow yet, so. Hmm. Here they are. Let me see them. having some trouble. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Except the hollow is like barely hollow. I don't know. So I didn't show this one last time because I wasn't really loving it but for comparison this is the sticker mule one which has this like big rainbow hollow to it as you can see. And then I wanted a smaller size. <laughs> this is sticker app. I don't think I'm gonna do hollow stickers after this because I, I really can't figure it out. Like, I'm doing something wrong and I don't know what. I'll still definitely have both in the store. I'm just kind of sad that I can't figure out how to get, like, the quality that I want. It's kind of cool though. Like, the more I look at it, the more I like this because it looks like it has this 3D effect to it almost. It's a little trippy. I think if you were to see this in person, it'll definitely be really cool. This is the sticker that I got from Sticker Meal. It is like super rainbow hollow, and I kind of wish I had the ability to make it just have the screen part be hollow, but I think with them, it was only like full hollow. What I should have done was make these clouds and the moon and star white so that it would really pop out. I think if that were the case, it would have been a lot better. And here is the sticker app one. So after I got this 3x3 sticker, I realized I didn't like the size and I thought this would be a lot better. This is around two and a half by one, I think. And as you can see, there's the hollow. This one specific sticker is a little damaged, but I think all the rest should be fine. It definitely looks better in person, but it's just really subtle on camera. Like, I think it's pretty nice to see like the difference between the screen part and the rest of the sticker because then all the colors of the rest of the sticker really stick out instead of just like being drowned out by this rainbow. <laughs> Maybe I'll try again but I hope you guys like these. Let me know which one's your favorite if you like the hollow with the more rainbow effect or the matte with just the screen because then I could try to see which one does better and make more of those. But for now, both of these will be in the store when I have my shop update in the coming week. And now moving on, I got a letter from my friend Kiki and I got an art trade from a friend on Instagram. so nicely. Wow, I love the sticker. I'm gonna try to keep it. Oh. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my, oh. The stamp is a lot bigger than I thought it was. I should read descriptions more thoroughly, <laughs> but this is my friend on Instagram. She goes by Paulina Misio. Sorry if I pronounced it wrong, but she makes some really cute art. And 
It was really funny because I found her art mostly through Etsy because there were a lot of Etsy recommendations for me, specifically this maple sticker and the Tom Nook sticker. And randomly, I saw her follow me on Instagram, so I followed her back and I was just like, oh my gosh, I love your work so much. This is so sweet, oh my gosh. And it's really nicely packaged too, so thank you for that. What a good boy. So many goodies. The thing I love most about her stickers is the sparkles. It is so pretty. I love it so much. It's all just so beautiful and enchanting. Like, I thought it was pretty funny that we both have these Timmy stickers. They're both really cute and I love the way that she did hers. Oh, so sweet. I was so happy to be able to trade with you. Thank you so much. And I hope you like the things that I gave you as well. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's so cute. This is really funny too, because what I sent her was like very bread bakery themed too. So it works out really well. Oh my goodness. Oh. Look at her. She's a cute little bear. Oh, I love. It says little Kuma. Oh, thank you, Kiki. I haven't even opened this yet. I'm gonna open this. I don't want to show the letter for privacy, but I really like this little bear and all the stamps around it as well. So cute! <laughs> I'm gonna read more of it later, but thank you so much! Now time to feature all the stickers! Look at the bread! It has this like nice texture. I love the way she textured each of the breads. It makes it feel very homey and soft. Oh. These are lovely as well. Just such nice warm colors. I don't think she gave me a business card in this one, but I do have one to show. I kept this from the first time we met at a convention. This is by my friend named Kiki. She goes by Hokey Boshi on Twitter and Instagram. I think both are the same. She's super sweet and I love the way that she draws her characters and she has this like very similar kind of warm overall theme to her work which is really pleasing to the eye and it makes me feel so comfy i love them so much thank you so much kiki i really treasure the letter that you wrote to me so i'll be reading and writing back to you thank you so much i think whenever i get mail now it definitely brightens up my day because i have like nothing else to look forward to during my days as sad as that sounds, it's just like wake up, go to work, play Animal Crossing, do some shop stuff, play some more Animal Crossing. So seeing some like cute stuff from friends really warms my heart. So thank you for that. And now I have a lot of things to decorate my journal with. I'm actually running out of pages in my um, traveler's notebook insert. So I think I'm gonna be starting a new one. And what better way to start than with new stickers! I feel like both these aesthetics kind of describe me really well too because I really love the warm but also the cool sparkly, like cute, so <laughs> they work well together. Well, that was the highlight of my day. I don't know what else is going to top that. I'm mostly just editing today and playing Animal Crossing. Today is Saturday so there's a fishing tourney going on in-game. I've been fishing a lot and I've been looking for the umbrella in-game, so most of my time will be dedicated to that. Mm -hmm.